Abu Dhabi Emirate is an arid region with no permanent fresh surface water and very little rainfall. Therefore, providing a constant water supply to help create suitable habitats for the Arabian oryx was a big challenge facing the Environment Agency of Abu Dhabi. Vast deserts are a difficult environment in which to secure a stable water supply. The temperature regularly exceeds 100 degrees Fahrenheit and sandstorms can be frequent. There is groundwater deep beneath the desert, but it has a very high salt content, which makes it unsuitable for drinking. Therefore, desalination plants will be required miles from the nearest supply of electricity. Because Arabian oryx are shy creatures, the locations of the 30 protected areas where they will be released have to be remote and far from most human contact. This makes it even more difficult to create the type of vegetation they require for both food and shade. Electricity will be required to pump up the groundwater and also to run the desalination plant. Because the remote locations were many miles away from any source of electricity, these were the challenges facing the team responsible for the Oryx release program in their quest for clean water for drinking and for irrigation of the protected areas. Uh, my name is Dr. Mohammed Dawood. I am the advisor of water resources at the Environment Agency of Abu Dhabi. Uh, as advisor for water resources, my role is uh, to uh, manage and uh, supervise all the related water resources uh, project, starting from groundwater and other related like the reuse of treated wastewater and desalination projects. The challenges uh, facing the project was many challenges. The first one is the geographical distribution. These uh, desalination plants are located in very remote areas and harsh areas with a very de harsh uh, desert condition. In addition to the existence of the resource of the raw water, which could be utilized, like the uh, brackish or saline water, either it could be deep or shallow, and also the, saline, the salinity of this water was very challenging. In some areas, we have the saline, uh, salinity of more than 60,000 ppm, which is double the seawater salinity. So there was a lot of challenging facing us at the beginning, and we have to plan it very carefully. Uh, also, the capital cost was a challenge, the operation and the maintenance later on after the construction uh, also is challenging for us. So we find that there is a lot of challenges that we have to blame for it at the beginning.